You dropped the ball on this one. <laughs> Pillow talk. Hey guys, welcome back to Pillow Talk Monday. It's Monday already. Oh my God, it was just Friday. This week on Pillow Talk, we're gonna talk about something that happens to all of us. It's nothing to be embarrassed or ashamed about. But it is the worst thing that can happen to you. And it has probably happened many times. Find out at 11 o'clock tonight. It can kill you <laughs> tonight at 11. It just happens when you least expect it. And it's devastating. Okay, and now you're all what like, is it? what is yeah. it? What is it? If it's not in the name of this video, because I don't know what we're going to title this video yet, I'll tell you what it is. Let them know, H. In the grand scheme of all of the things that are the worst in the world. In the universe. It's losing a loved one. Running into your ex. That's yes. Those are that's, that's the, the two. Order. Those are the order. That's it. And then there's everything, everything else. else follows. So if you're not out or you haven't had a girlfriend yet, you are one of the lucky ones. Or you can go out amongst the people, just carefree. Or if you're one of like the worst types of people, and I say this like with all of my heart, who is like I'm friends with all of my exes, no. you're a psychopath. This video isn't for you. And also, people don't want to date you. There are different ways, though, that we go about, you know, running into an ex. Right. It's just as bad for everyone, but the reactions vary. Let's let's say me for an example. Yeah. I run into my ex give, several times. Give us some examples. Okay, but I do have a certain way that I react. and it's, Across the board, no matter who the ex is. No matter who it is, <laughs> I run away. And I run away. She means it literally. You literally guys. run away. On her feet, run. I run into an ex at a grocery store. It was like I was picking up an apple, our eyes locked. I drop the apple and I am not exaggerating. I ran. <laughs> and I did not want to go through that confrontation. I tried to right. avoid that confrontation. Mm. And I ran. You might see us out in Toronto. You might see us out in Los Angeles. And the only time Adriana is running <laughs> is away from an ex. So if you see that, please, please give her some privacy. Give her space. Let her run to where she's going. Let me just keep running until I can't run no more. Another time, yeah. I was on a streetcar. And streetcars in Toronto are not very big. It was a small streetcar. Uh -huh. And my ex got on. And the next stop, I got off. Was it my stop? No. Definitely not, not even freaking close to my stop. And I walked home. And sometimes it's tough dealing with your ex or relationships in general. Um, so this video is sponsored by BetterHelp.com. It's super easy to sign up. They ask you a few questions about yourself, what type of counselor that you want, and you get a counselor immediately. So what BetterHelp is, it's affordable private counseling from wherever you want, in your bed, <laughs> on the couch, while you're eating dinner. Yeah. And you can pick what type of counselor you want. You can choose if you want an LGBTQ counselor, which is pretty great. Sometimes they cannot replace having like going to see an actual physical psychologist or psychiatrist. They are just someone that is a trained professional yeah. that's there to help you talk about why you run away from your ex. And you can't change your ex. It has happened. That person is your ex forever but on BetterHelp, you could change your counselor. <laughs> Running into your ex, mm -hmm. it doesn't matter if you ended things well or not, it's awkward across the board. Yeah, because you've probably seen them naked. I was just gonna say, because they've seen you naked. <laughs> so it's just awkward. <laughs> See, I have a little bit of a different approach. Yeah. You know, like fashion where it's like dress every day like you're going out on the runway? Yeah, that's how I live my life. <laughs> Dress every day like it's a pajama party, maybe. I dress every day like I'm going to run into my ex. There's nothing worse than running into your ex when you're on like your period and you have bad skin and you're bloated and you went out for a Why do you tub think of ice cream. I run away, Sarah? <laughs> Especially like what do you do if you know an ex is gonna be at an event or be somewhere? I don't go. I would put on <laughs> lipstick. That Sarah will just, oh, my ex is going to be there. I'm just going to put on a little bit of lipstick. I put on my nicest clothes. I have moved countries to avoid exes, Sarah. Me, it depends. I think it, it also depends. depends, too, if you want your ex back. Because there's just 
there's the ex that you don't want back. I think we're talking about the ex. Oh, see, and then the ex you want back. Your behavior might be the ex you don't want back. Well, you might, Mine might be that I want her back. No, I still feel like because you can be like, I don't want you back. I just want you to know that you messed up. And that I'm I can amazing. live without you. I know what he, who are you? That's a, that means that's how you should treat when you run into ex. Pretend you don't know them, right? And you're like, new phone, who dis? And they're like, we dated for eight years. And I'm like, girl, you don't even ring a bell to me. And they'd be like, oh my god, Adriana has amnesia. <laughs> so say you've just run into your ex and you're like, I need better help. I ran away. It costs between $35 and $65 per week. And that's for unlimited access to your counselor, unlimited talking, as unlimited sessions. As much as you can handle. Yes. As it many exes as you run into. There is no limit. You can send messages, direct messages. You can do FaceTime calls or you can do phone calls. So it's whatever you're comfortable with. You could set it up with your counselor. Messages are great because you can just send them if you're like, I just ran into my ex now. I ran away. <laughs> I, so I ran, I physically ran away. Yeah. This isn't a metaphor. So you guys can sign up at betterhelp.com slash pillow talk. The link to sign up is in our description. And if you sign up, you get 10% off of your first month. So um, what type of X runner into are you? Good sentence, maybe. That was that made sense, right? Yeah, let us know in the comments what you do when you guys run into your ex. You know what I also bet lesbians do? This has never happened to me, but I bet I bet some lesbians run into their ex-girlfriend, which leads them getting back together. A hundred thousand percent. <laughs> Make sure to subscribe because every week we have amazing advice. Oh my god, it's incredible. Like <laughs> how are we still doing it? I don't know. We just get older and wiser, I guess. Yeah, yeah. Thank you guys for watching Pillow Talk Monday. We'll see you next Monday. Bye-bye.